hello guys welcome to this tutorial today this is income spinner your favorite youtube channel for money making tips and opportunity guys if today is your first time on this channel i want you to please subscribe to this channel and like this video and also share this video so today i want to walk you through step by step how you can link your nigerian bank card to your paypal account that we created the other day so if you have not watched that video come to income spinner this is the channel please subscribe to this channel i beg of you and also come to this video how to open a verified paypal account and then you click on it and watch this video this video is going to walk you through step by step on how to create your own paypal account okay this is going to walk you through step by step so you watch this video and then you'll be able to create your own paypal account now why am i doing this next video okay now this next video is inspired by these questions i've had in my comment section look at this question he said hello chief how can i link my nigerian bank card to the created paypal account since the billing address is uae's address please help with this thanks now thank you so much for this positive feedback that means you have created your PayPal account already. Congratulations to you. All right. The next question is, I was, re I was requested to submit an ID, either pass passport, driver's license, or national ID. What am I supposed to do, please? Now, I'll get to this answer uh, shortly, but today I want to talk about But Meanwhile, you can submit your NIA. N I N N I N submit your N I N that was what I submitted if you have a driver license submit your Nigerian documents are accepted okay all right so the next question is did you use a UAE uh, VPN or Nigerian IP which country card will you link UEA or Nigeria what is if you are asked to upload the picture of the document will you use a UAE one or Nigerian one, just use your Nigerian um, card, I mean, your Nigerian document, your Nigerian ID to upload whenever they request for it, okay? Now, your video is okay. Thank you. Thanks for the lecture. But we can't add a Nigerian bank card or debit card. I've tried severally and it is rejected. All right. So, guys, I'm going to show you how to solve this problem problem okay because one thing is to open a paypal account another thing is for you to be able to get your money out so guys please if this video is adding value to you please kindly subscribe to this channel and turn on your notification bell so that youtube can always notify you whenever i upload videos like this you'll be the first to watch it and implement the strategies in it all right guys so let's go to our paypal account that we created the other day the paypal account that we created the other day and now uh, go ahead with the linking of our nigerian bank card all right so if you come to your home page like this you will see your dashboard you will see um link and confirm my debit or credit card or you can come to pay and get paid click on it and select banks and cards all right those are the options so you can click here or you click here it will all lead you to the same place ultimately so when you click on bank and card you come to link a card link a new card this is link a new bank i will do another video and show you the bank account you can add to your paypal and withdraw your money to your Nigerian uh, um, to Nigerian bank. Okay, so watch out for that next video. All right. So, but for today, I want to show you how to link your bank card. All right. So you click on link a new card. Wait for it to open. 
All right, when this open, what you need to do next is enter the card number. All right, I already used this card, so I'm, I'm just going to fill. So the next thing I'm going to add there is my security number, right? So I'm going to enter that. So I believe that all of you know how to do this. So you click on, all right? You click on this link a card or link card now it's going to go this card is linked to another paypal account please remove the card from the other account and try a different payment method or try a different payment method so guys this very card is linked already to one of my paypal account that's why i cannot link it here again so but the, the bottom line is that this card works. Now, what is a card? This information, I actually paid money to get it, but I'm going to spill it for free for you right here. So the card we are talking about is called UBA Africa. UBA Africa, right? It is a prepared card. All you need to do is walk into any branch of UBA Bank ask request for uba africa africa they will give you they will issue the card you don't need to have an account with uba that account that card is not linked to any of your account it's an instant and personalized not linked to any to an account all right so you can get this card once they issue you with that card all you need to do is come back to your paypal account go through the process, add it. I don't have it too. That's why I cannot add it again to this new account. I have added it before, so I can't repeat it again, right? So now, but there are certain things I want to tell you about the UBA Africa card. One, the cards come in two. There is a Naira Africa card, the Naira prepared card, and also the dollar prepared card. So when you are collecting this card, you need to choose between the Naira and the dollar, okay? And they will give you a form to fill. You fill that form instantly. They will issue you that card. When they issue you that card, you come here and then you will be able to add that card. Now, another thing I want to let you know about the UBA Africa card, when you link it to your PayPal account is that Anytime you want to make withdrawal to that card, PayPal will charge you $5. If, assuming you have $10 in your PayPal and you want to transfer that $10 to your uh, bank account via your Africa uh, Afri uh, Afri card, PayPal is going to deduct $5 from that amount. Even if you have $1 million in your PayPal, Anytime you want to withdraw using the card, they will take $5. It is a flat rate, okay? This is very important for you to take note of. So uh, that means if you have like $6 and you want to withdraw the $6, transfer it to your bank using the card, PayPal will take $5 and you'll only be given um, $1. And another thing I wanted to take note is that any withdrawal you make is good. PayPal is going to pay you in the current central bank rate, not black market rate. All right. So if you want to enjoy black market rate, I'm going to do another video that I will show you how to move this money to a bank account that is going to pay you at the black market rate. So guys, if you've gotten value from this, I want you to hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell. I'm going to do another video that is going to answer this question. So how to link your bank card to your PayPal account. The next one is going to be how to link your account, your bank account to your PayPal account and then withdraw that money and enjoy the exchange rate at the black market rate. So guys, this is all for this video. We'll see you in the next one. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. 
Thank you, guys. See you in the next one. Bye.